I was just holding it apparently. Maybe she'll poop for us or something. That'd be fun. <laughs> Welcome to Heavy Petting with Sherry Hardman. Our guest today is Jenny Shaw. Okay. Jenny and I, we've been friends for, what, a couple of years now maybe? Yeah. We met doing direct sales together. And as soon as your dog comes back in the room, I'll have you introduce your dog. Stuffer. New environment, got to explore. Yes. Right, I decided to stay out of the frame so that I can at least get video of your dog if she decides to move around. Good. Oh. All right, so what kind of dog is Scupper? So Scupper is a Newfoundland. She is a water dog. They were bred for uh, water rescue and um, being on ships. And so like they're good swimmers? They're very good swimmers. They have webbed feet. Oh, it's wow. crazy. She loves the water. She's also really good with kids because I have a four-year-old and a six-year-old. Right. They fall all over her and chase mm. her around, and she's just amazing with them. And um, she's not a small dog, as you can see. I can but see that. She's very... How much does she weigh, do you know? She is 96 pounds. She's actually kind of on the small side for a new feed. Really? Uh, yeah. But she's... <clears throat> Even though I'm holding the camera, you're still going to stay out of camera range. It's okay. Let her do what she wants to do. It's just a lot of you just sitting there by yourself. Luckily, you're cute, so. Yeah. Yeah. Can you shake? Can you shake? Sit. She, she's, um, she's very bonded to me when we're at home and I'm just watching TV. She mm -hmm. likes to come over and hold my hand. Oh, really? I taught her to shake, and so now she'll just sit there and she'll just put her paw in my hand and she'll oh. sit there like that. Oh. She's not really a cuddler because she's so hot. She's got a double coat. Oh. So she doesn't really get up on the couch and like she's not cut Right. Either. Yeah. But she likes to be near me. She's very bonded to me. We should have named her Shadow because wherever I am, she wants to be. Now how, what? how old is she? She's two. We actually oh. got her Labor Day two years ago. And um, It's almost your anniversary. Yes. Your doggy anniversary. Yes. I'm working on my husband to get another one. Really? Mm -hmm. Now, do you guys have a big house? Um, it's like 2,400 square feet. Mm -hmm. It's not huge, but we've got almost a quarter acre. So, so she's got lots of room. She's to... got lots of room, and she's lazy. So what? Yeah. Did you hear what she's saying about you? Yeah. So she runs around for like 10 or 15 minutes, and then she just sleeps all day. Well, but she really she is beautiful. We oh, really? <laughs> oh, yeah. We got her a little kiddie pool, and uh -huh. she wants to just lay in that when it gets really hot. Mm -hmm. So She seems really even-tempered, like oh. the other animals haven't bothered her at all. Oh, yeah, no, she is awesome. My friends have a little chewini, and um, he came over and had a Hi. Little, He had a bone that she wanted, and he was defending it from her and wound up chasing her all over the yard. <laughs> so it was really funny to see this little teeny tiny dog chasing this huge new all over the yard. It was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, well, we don't all need to be a badass, right? No, she just looks badass, and she's got yeah. a really badass bark, which is another nice thing, because, you know, no one's going to come into our house with a right. big, black, scary-looking dog. No, I know I wouldn't. Bark. I know I wouldn't. Are you looking at the door? You just want to get the heck out of here already? Really? You're just s smelling something. Yeah. Well, we decided to, to not have the barky dog here. Oh, there's a cat there. That's why. Oh. That's yeah. Turbo. Turbo's not very friendly. She's used to cats, too. We have four cats. Oh, wow. Four cats, two kids in Newfoundland, and a husband. You have your hands full. Just a little. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you have anything going on business-wise that you want to talk about? or? Um. Well, I sell hair care products. So if you're interested in naturally based shampoo, conditioner, and styling products, you can go to sassyhaircare.com. Okay. Um, we have some awesome new products that just came out that really? are really hydrating that I really like because my hair tends to get greasy, but it also gets really dry on the ends. Mm -hmm. And 
these products help with the hydration without making my hair greasy. Oh, nice. Really yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, I know I have the same issue. Yeah. Yeah. So I was really excited about that. Okay. Well, cool. I'll be sure to put your link in the in the comment section of this video. Awesome. All right. So if your dog was going to write a review about you, what would she say? Um, I need to play with her more. She wants me to play with her all the time. She'll come up and she'll like stick her head if I'm sitting with my phone she'll stick her head under my arm and like toss it so that my phone <laughs> goes flying um and then she'll grab my hand and pull because mm -hmm. she wants me to get up and go play with her oh so that's that. that's it and everybody scratch my butt. She wants oh. me to scratch my butt all the time. that's what my review would say too yes mm -hmm. let's talk about heavy petting of the human variety oh yeah you have any interesting fun stories that you could share well when I was about 25, so we're talking a year almost, ago. Yeah, 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 a year ago. Um, a year ago, but this was before like Skyping or FaceTiming or anything like that. Um, I was uh, online dating and I met a guy who was in the armed forces and he was in Wenatchee or something like that for about six weeks when we first started talking. So we talked for a long time relatively before we got to meet so our first date was me picking him up at the airport when he got back because I figured that was safe right right the airport lots right. of people if I decided to nope out of there um, he had easy he access a cab. to yeah. get home <laughs> right so I met him and I was like so you know what do you want to we were gonna go get something to eat he wanted to go to Taco Bell and I was like I'm not, I'm not a princess by any stretch of the imagination. I'm like, this is a first date, mm -hmm. and you want to go to Taco Bell? Mm -hmm. I don't do Taco Bell. I don't, I don't mm -hmm. do Taco Bell. So I made some. I was like, well, I got sick there once. So I really don't eat there very much. I don't eat there anymore. Can we do something else? He's like, okay. I'm twenty. We're twenty five, right? We're not broke college students. He's an officer. It's not like he's an right. enlisted. Like right. he's like, well, let's go to Old Country Buffet. <laughs> I'm like, I've already mixed one thing, so I'm like, okay, all right, all right, I'm fine, I like a buffet, that's good, mm -hmm. all right. So we go to the Old Country Buffet, and this dude, who, he's in the military, right? So you've got to have a certain standard of, like, fitness. Mm -hmm. He puts away, like, four or five plates of food. And I'm not talking about, like, like salads. I mean, I'm, like, steak and ribs uh -huh. and, like, they are full plates of food. And I'm not one of those chicks that goes and eats, like, a salad and drinks a glass of water. I eat a meal. Uh -huh. But I was just kind of like, okay, so I see why you wanted to go someplace, like, Taco, Ta Taco Bell, where you could have a lot of food for uh -huh. not a lot of money or a buffet. I get it. Okay. And maybe the food is terrible. He was there for six weeks. You know, I'm trying uh -huh. not to right, be like right. all judgy pants. So then um, I take him home and we both read a lot. So he had a book that I was going to borrow. So I go up and this was pre hookup culture, right? So this was not when people would just go on a date and hook up and have like random stranger sex. People do that nowadays, apparently. I don't, but... Oh, I um, never did that at all. I didn't either. <laughs> well, no, I really didn't. Oh. But yeah. <laughs> I, was gonna say, I, mean, I don't think there ever was a day when that didn't happen. But well, yeah. I guess maybe yeah. you just hear about it a lot more now. Right, that's true. But, that's true. So I'm, we go up, and I'm looking at his bookshelf, and I'm browsing and everything, and he excuses himself, and I'm browsing, and I turn around, and he comes back out, buck naked and no. raring to go. And I've got a book in my hand, and I'm like, put your pants on. Uh, and he's like, oh, I thought we were going to do this. And I'm like, do do what exactly? Put your pants on. And he's like, don't you want this? I'm like, no, no. I wanted to borrow a book. Now I don't. I'll see you later. And I left. And I was just like. Well, and then you have to wonder, that has to have worked for him in the past, or he wouldn't continue to do it, you would think. Who are these women that are... I don't have any idea. But, I mean, seriously, like, 
this was back, I mean, not to like show my age or anything, but this was back before you even really had camera phones. But I'm sure that if he's still dating, he's sending dick pics right and left. <laughs> good date either. I mean, Old Country Buffet, if you want to get in my pants, you're going to have to take me at least to Applebee's or something. Right. Well, who wants to eat? I mean, who wants to have sex after eating five plates of food? Apparently him. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I don't know, but it was, it was... It'd be funny if we could tell these stories and then show pictures of the people. That would be hilarious. Yes. Watch out for this guy, the, the old country buffet, <laughs> what do we call him? I don't know. That's funny. <laughs> Naked old country buffet dude. I don't know. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's interesting. Yeah. Apparently old country buffet gets him in the mood. <laughs> yes. All right. So, yes. And today's your birthday. Happy Today, birthday. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. So I'm... nice of you to come over here. Are you yeah. doing something special? Yes. We're going to dinner tonight with my family and everybody. And uh, my husband's taking a half day. Are you going to Old Country Buffet? or? <laughs> I don't even know how I got to be this old, you know? Seems like just yesterday, I was getting finger banged at a Styx concert. Today, I got finger banged at Old Country Buffet. It's not the same, it really isn't. You know, they called it an early bird special. I, I did go back for seconds, I admit. What's on her mind? She's a big, big girl in a skinny woman's world. Now she's a big, big girl in a skinny woman's world. Now she's a big, big girl.